it's a little bouncy right now. Okay, I am in the middle of a home project. We are painting another room in our uh, the office where I work, and Aaron got a new desk for me, so we're gonna set that up and everything. It's already set up, but once I get done painting, I'll be able to put all that together. That video is going up on my main channel tomorrow, which is just Kimmy Cope. But right now, I've got my crock pot out. I've got a bunch of stuff over here. We got potatoes that are already got the thing on them. Uh, peas, lentil, uh, not lentil. What are these? Lima beans, carrots, beef broth, corn, diced tomatoes. And then I'm making it easy today. Just a slow cooker vegetable beef stew seasoning packet, which I have another grocery haul going up today on my main channel and kind of like a restock and everything. So what we're going to do right now is I need to grab a liner, crock pot liner. I love these things. Hello. Happy to see you too. Okay. But I knew I needed to go ahead and get this going or else... It ain't going to be done until 10 o'clock at night, so I'm going to go ahead and... Now, this is something I would put just do in the on top of the stove, but because I've got other things to do today, uh, we're just going to put it in here and let it cook on its own. That way, I don't have to wash it. Okay, thought about going live on Instagram and I was like oh no I'm monetized over here let's do it over here <laughs> anyways I love being a business woman all right that's in there I'm going to do the veggies first then we'll do the liquids so I'm gonna bring y'all over here because we've got some stuff to rinse off I'm sorry I'm about to spin you around <laughs> okay we got it dishes that need to be done. Okay. Thankfully, the only thing I have to rinse are these potatoes. I'm going to use all of these because we just bought a new one and I just need to get these things off of here. And I can start chopping everything. It is so cold that this water feels like a bunch of little needles. I hope I have hot water tonight. The other day I took a shower and I think it's because I washed dishes before, like right before, and used hot water. That way I went to get in the shower, it was just not even warm and i still took the shower so i wanted to be clean all right this is the boring part my salsa drips. <laughs> well, don't worry. It doesn't really fall so much. Oh, that's why we haven't done anything about it, to be honest. Okay. If the water bill starts getting to like 30 bucks, I will. <laughs> I'm just drying these off. But they're still good. If you've got potatoes that look like that, that have the um, little things sprouting on the outside, just take them off. And I normally kind of dig my nail into it a little bit, so you just see, like, the actual potato. Hi. You can't hear me. I wonder why. Can y'all hear me now? Is it because I am was farther away? Or was it just with the water running? So I'm going to move that back i haven't turned it on yet i don't think my mic is covered in any way but let me know okay oh 
this is nice. Y'all can actually see. I don't have to put you down here. That's good. Wallflower, you see me down there? Oh, that just went straight into the sink. <laughs> I've got a favorite knife. I hope it's clean. I don't know. I don't see it. Oh, no. I don't know what we would have used it for. Yeah. My favorite. Okay, you can hear them. Good. I'm going to put the potatoes at the bottom. I'm going to do them in little cubes. Kind of like that. You know. Should I make them smaller? I probably should. Because this is vegetable soup. All right. I'm going to make them smaller. I'm going to do like that. Because I'm sure they're going to shrink up a little bit anyway. I need to remember from now on if I want to go live, do it on YouTube. the thing that lets me speed up. We can't speed up in real life, can we? That's kind of funny. Okay. I'm going to play the paint that wall and get all that stuff. I don't think I'm ignoring you if you leave a comment. I will look. Alright. Oh, good. We only have two left. I'm so used to speeding things up. I feel like I'm going so slow. Okay. This had a little black spot on it. I don't use those. Oh well. One more potato. The other stuff will be easy because I'm just kind of dumping it in. Make sure. Okay. Okay. I still feel like today is a Friday. Today is only Tuesday. Maybe I should chop the potatoes before. Okay, I'm not going to use that piece because that's got a bunch of stuff on it. All right, we got our potato in here. I don't. Oh, I do. I do still need that. I'm going to cut my carrots up because they're pretty chunky, and carrots take forever. And I'm only going to use maybe that much. I'm going to use some of those for a vegetable soup that I'm planning to do. The same way. I'm just going to cut these baby ones in threes. I bought a bunch of junk food last week. Or it was really... Y'all saw it a few days ago, but for us, it has been about four days ago. So, we, we had one more pack of meat left. I mean, I'm afraid that she's going to eat. Yeah. Because I wanted to cook. Cook. You ever in the mood to cook, and then sometimes you're just not? <laughs> but, um, I was seeing people do crock pot meals, and I'm like, why? Why do I not think about that when I'm thinking about convenience and, like, fast food you know what i mean not like out to eat but just fast and i'm like crock pots so fast and it's a way that i can eat more whole foods 
because it just all goes in the pot and then when it's done it's done you eat so but i am gonna cook this on high because it's already later in the day okay so i've probably got a cup of carrots in there now i'm going to you know what let's just go ahead and do that I've got frozen corn right here I'm going to use because I've had it longer than the canned corn. Now, I like corn, so I'm not holding back. Ooh, this makes me think corn chowder, that'd be good. All right, sorry, this is probably so loud. These are peas. Just make sure they've been in there for a while. Alright, let's just use that whole thing. That's great. <sighs> okay, now, oh, lima beans. Ooh, I, I think I've got, I might have some spinach I'll throw in here if I do. And this is why I like stuff like this because you can have some stuff. So I just put a little, like a little handful of this. Oh, well, I do too. Corn is so good. It is my favorite. <laughs> Corn is like bacon of vegetables to me. Okay. Oh, there it is. I knew I had some. Okay, and this I could put my chicken noodle soup too, spinach, because you never know. Um, oh yes, it is a live stream. So I figured um, I could just do both on here. Okay, this is chunky. I'm gonna put a little bit of this in here. I'd say I put in like a third, uh, well, three fourths of a cup, probably. Not too, not too much like one whole cup. That didn't even sound right. <laughs> not completely a cup, but mostly. Okay, and I just put these back like that. And then they go back in the freezer. And I'm going to use this bag for my carrots right here. And then I'm so sorry for you. So I save a bag. Oh. All that there, which is fine, but I would if I was peeling it to make mashed potatoes. But we're doing our Christmas on the 23rd. I'm excited. We just found out last night after I mentioned in the in the grocery haul video that went up today or is going up. I was like, I don't know when we're doing it, and then. She text messaged me. So we must have been thinking the same thing. Because she didn't know. Okay. I have got a thing of diced tomatoes. And I'm just going to dump the whole thing in there. This one has onion and roasted garlic. But you could use whatever you want. <laughs> yeah, it does look like it's got ears. Which, I, I don't know if those would actually grow, but I know it, uh, that's what they look like whenever you go to put them in the ground. And you cut off wherever the eyes are, like, you know, chunks, and then you plant it. I am, I am thinking about doing a garden this year. I'm 
miss it. I did it for five years. No. Yeah. And then I didn't do it last year. So, we've got our tomatoes. Sorry. I have to keep them warm. Now, something I don't do is add the ground beef in right away. Only because I feel like when the meat, like the ground beef is already cooked and then I go in to put it in here, then it's just going to almost become like boiled and then all the flavor would go into the rest of the food, which is good. But I just feel like the ground beef is something I do on the side, maybe 30 minutes before we eat dinner and then I just throw it in to get incorporated into all that. So for our liquid, I'm, I'm using that kind of splashed out a lot. I need to learn how to do it this way. I'm left-handed, but I always put the camera on my left side. Um, we got a whole thing of beef broth right here. So this is gonna be really good. Okay. And then I'm gonna add the seasoning packet, which this brand is Origin Farms. It's just a vegetable stew seasoning packet. And I don't follow the directions <laughs> on the back. Okay, now let me get my stuff out of the way. Getting loaded up on dishes. That's why I bought paper plates. Okay, sorry. <laughs> real life. My real life. <laughs> okay, I think there's enough liquid in there. I am just going to find one. Oh, here we go. I didn't want to have to dirty up too, so I'm gonna use this. I like to rinse them off, because we leave these spatulas out of a cabinet so you know if I don't use it it'll get kind of dusty so okay I need to bring y'all over here almost paused you <laughs> I'm not filming this is live uh, frozen meatballs and sauce in my crock pot for meatball sammy's today spaghetti and meatballs tomorrow that sounds delicious okay here we go stir all this and we'll go ahead and put it on high and yeah we got plenty plenty of liquid because we know the corn was frozen all pretty much all the vegetables were frozen except for the tomato potato and carrot but they were all cooked down because everybody that has water oh yum you know what this is making me think of with the spinach floating in here is it called wedding soup where it has the little tiny like sausages in it? Oh my gosh. I've never had like a homemade kind of that. We need to make it. Um, we need to do that. Yeah. All right. This smells good by the way. So I'm just going to leave this over here. I'll rinse it off when I need to go to use it and we're good to go. That's going to go and cook for the rest of the day. And then I'll do the ground beef and put that in there. So yeah, let's see. I see it one comment with a question mark. Cause that's all I have planned <laughs> for today. I just wanted to hang out with y'all for a minute while I did this. Okay, let's see. Um, oh yes, crock pot liners are awesome. Um, the, they don't melt. They can stick to the pot itself and like leave some marks, but then when you wash it, the marks are gone. Um, but the, it's, it's like a heat, a heat resistant kind. So it works. And this is the generic brand, it's the food line. Let's see. This is the kind I have. But um, they have the 
name brand too. I can't think of it, but it's like the whole box is blue. But at my food line, this is my paint, my paint clothes. Um, at at uh, food line, all I have seen from that name brand is the oven bags, and it's because of the holidays. Erin was like, I wonder if we're ever gonna get lucky again with those ham. They're the big pieces of ham, like a big slice of ham, thick, with the eye in it. And we found them multiple times for like $1.75, and it could feed three people easily. And now they're like five bucks, and I said, well, it's ham season. <laughs> it is ham season. They're probably not gonna be on sale for a while. Okay. All right, y'all. Well, this was fun. Um, I will post a picture on the community tab later. Yeah, the liners are a time saver. Oh, they have 30 packs. That's a that's a good idea to order those on Amazon because we do order our um, air fryer liners there. What was I going to tell y'all? I'll post a picture of this later um, and let you know if it tastes good or not, but I'm pretty positive it will. So, if y'all want vegetable soup, there you go. We threw in the whole, the whole everything we had. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get off of here. I'm gonna go paint. I will see y'all later.